Hello, everybody, and welcome to episode 70 of my chest basement series, the show where we attempt to collect a chest full of every item in the game. Did some running around before I started recording, which is why the hunger bar was a little bit lower. Um, today we are going to begin our collection of items. Uh, but first, a little bit of a recap of the rules, as this will be the episode that I link a lot of people to as the actual start of the series. So, this series is about collecting, as I said, a chest full of every item in the game. Um, so, 27 stacks if the item is stackable, and 27 items if the item is not stackable. Um, the item list I am using is the creative mode all items list. So, if you go into creative mode and then um, open up the inventory and click on all items, those are listed here in order, um, all the way around. So we go from stone to a bowl, and then I dug out a second room in these first 69 episodes, um, and we go from mushroom stew then all the way towards um, a book of mending. And so I don't think any of the chests have anything in them actually strike that. I think, I don't know where anything is, of course. I created the, okay, I won't, I won't, I will not look around. I believe somewhere I have some item frames already in a chest, but, and there's some stone. <laughs> but other, other than that, um, this is where we're starting. We have nothing collected. I'll kind of do a run through of chests. This is the stuff I've gotten mining. Um, we do have a stack of diamonds already. Yay. Um, this is my more general chest. We have two pieces of armor that I'm waiting to enchant. Um, this is just kind of my storage room. Upstairs, we have some farms. And then we have the mines down here, which is where I'm going to be for the majority of this episode while I kind of talk. I have also decided that I'm mining on a too high of a level. Take a look here. We are mining on level 12. I did some research. Apparently, um, on this level, we're mining at um, levels. We're seeing a le levels 11, 12, 13, and 14. Confirm that. Looking at level 14 and level 11. Um, level 14 has a lower concentration of diamonds than does 13 um, and the levels below. So we are going to want to be one level lower than we are right now. So I guess I'll start that here. I'll just move everything down a, little, down a layer. Um, I, I did some research. Apparently the lava lakes don't start until level 10, according to my research. So we're going to roll with that theory and do our mining here instead. I am going to make sure we go down and ensure that, oops, oh, we made it. This is going to take a long time and be kind of inefficient. Anyway, um, this series is played on Minecraft 1.9.2. I decided that I needed to cap it at some version of the game, otherwise the new items would just kind of go on forever and would not give this already seemingly impossible series um, an end. Uh, at some point, I'm going to have to go down a level here, too. Let's just, like, go down, and then we'll go. I'll keep it three tall. Why not? I want to make sure that my first tunnel at the lower level actually gets through to this end. Give it a lot of see what we can find. Definitely lava somewhere around here. And of course, I don't have blocks in my bar. Why would I? What have we found? I think this proves my point. We have a lava lake here, and we are looking at... Uh, wait, there's no blocks. Light, uh, okay, this is actually level 11. Well, wait. Am I trolling? Yeah, so they would be at our feet. Okay, I'm just having to confirm with myself that I'm not crazy. Let's do that real quick. Sorry for this interruption. I did not expect to find this, but... You never know it lurks on the edge of these. Um, it's a nice place to find diamonds, so apparently some iron. Yeah. 
Where am I? Anyway, okay, let me attempt to continue explaining this so that you don't have too much video to watch. Uh, if you're just checking in for the, uh, the recap. The list of items, I made a uh, spreadsheet of them, and they will be linked in the description below so you can kind of follow along. I will be updating that when I finish the chest of some item, and I will note um, by that item that that is completed. So you will know. This is the end. I, I come to the end. I think I've, I think I've come to the end. Oh, come on. And gravel. Yeah, of course. Whatever. Let's eat some food. Um, so yeah, 1.9.2. And for items that are unobtainable in uh, the appropriate quantity, let's just grab everything that we can find here. Oh my. Um, if it's not found, basically if there's not 27 stacks of it uh, in a standard Minecraft world, then I will be collecting as much as I possibly can. Um, I'm not sure if that is going to be the case for actually basically any items. Um, so I'm not anticipating that being a large problem. But we'll see. Maybe it will be. It seems unlikely to me that there would be a non-renewable item that an entire world does not have enough of. But, yeah, I don't know. Um, what other things should I note about this series? I'm going to get lost, by the way. So you know I get lost very easily caving. I am playing on normal difficulty, but with the mob spawn turned off. Um, basically, I would be playing on peaceful difficulty. Just That's how I play Minecraft. Um, but I do occasionally, of course, need monsters um, in order to farm certain items. So I will be turning that on when I need it, but off because basically I don't want to get scared by creepers. That's really the reason. I have a really large steroid reaction. So creepers do not end well with me. I jump out of my chair and scream and it's not ideal. So, but I'm leaving on the normal difficulty for the hunger, uh, even though that's not really a problem in this game. I don't know. It seemed like it would be fun. So doing that as well. Let me just block this up and keep going a little bit. I'm sure we're far enough at this point. Just why not keep going? Um, also, for those of you wondering, this is a, an extremely long series, obviously. I doubt I will finish um, ever, but doing it for fun, not necessarily just to finish it, so keep that in mind. And. If you have any questions for me um, about life, about any, basically anything, I will answer them in a future episode if you leave them in the comments. Kind of making this into kind of a podcast of sorts, just because I do need something to talk about, and I will get to those questions. Feel free to leave as many as you'd like. But as I said, that spreadsheet will be linked in the description. You can kind of look at all the items that are in a list, find some ones that you think might be uh, especially difficult. And we'll, we'll see. We'll see what we can do. My general theory is I'm going to collect the raw items first. Um, for example, let's just ignore all this and start over here. So let me just make sure that I'm doing this correctly. On 11, I'm looking at level 10, which is where all the lava is going to be. And then, good. This should give me the best chance to find diamonds. And then let me start this direction. Excellent. Okay. So I'm going to collect like my chest full of iron before I make iron leggings or whatever. Um, no particular reason to do this. Let me actually go a little bit farther just so I... Oops. Yeah, so collect the iron before I start making like iron pants and iron shovels and whatever. Um, I don't know if that makes any sense. This is a working hypothesis. If you have suggestions about how to do this, let me know. If you have suggestions about any of this, again, let me know. I'd be happy to take your suggestions. Oh, cool. Oh my god. Oh my. That's a lot of coal. I 
guess I'll drop the seed in chat. Why not? There's the seed. I don't know what version this was created. This world was created created on actually. Uh, so I do apologize for that. I created it before 192 and then um, kept it on 192. Hello. What do I This is going to be kind of frustrating to have that I'm. Hello. Maybe this time. Let's just keep going. Um, I just have locked it in 192, obviously, with the features you can do in the launcher so that we don't get out updated, essentially. The general way these episodes are going to work is some of them will just be mining and I'll be talking. Maybe if I have something specific to talk about, I will maybe make that a mining episode. Or there'll be uh, probably a series of episodes whenever I go exploring, since I do have to go kind of far afield actually to get into some 192 generated terrain. Um, since this, I'm out of torches. Since I did create this world a while ago, um, the areas that, like this area that I'm settled in is not 1.9.2 terrain. Uh, it's actually 1. Point whatever the world was created on. So, some of the stuff that was added in 192 I'll have to go farther afield for. I also at some point would like to locate all of the biomes, just to make sure that I have a record of where they all are. That is a giant vein of iron. I don't really know why I did that. I, I really like to make sh the, next, the next one over feel really unique. So there'll be times I go exploring. Um, basically, I'll have a diamond. Yay. I'll have something that I'm looking for in mind, probably, when I do that. Um, and then I will go find it, hopefully, or not. Let me go back to that diamond in a sec. I can't even mine over to see where I am. As usual, let's mine around. <laughs> let's mine around it, he says, while breaking it. Just want to make sure there's no, no lava around it, and so I just want to look at it for a little bit longer. Okay, we have one, two, three, four, five, six. I think we have six, six ores. I'll see how many diamonds we can get from it. Four, five, six, ten diamonds. So not, not super great. Um, this is a. Efficiency 5, and breaking 3, fortune 3, mending pickaxe. Um, this pickaxe, I, I doubt, will ever die unless I unless I die and lose it in lava, um, which I would be very sad about. Well, that's nice, our first diamond at this uh, new level, and kind of of the series now that we're actually out collecting. Um, it's a nice start. I should be able to fill up the uh, the stone and cobblestone pretty pretty quickly. I'll do that shortly, just so we kind of have some something actually done um, that I can you know change on the spreadsheet and actually feel good about. In these some I think seven hundred odd items. Any final notes before I basically leave off the recap section? I don't think so. Um, I will make an attempt to record everything I do. Um, wait, my upper level. Ah, I see. I'll make an attempt to record everything, the, everything that I do. If I am unable to do so because of technical problems, generally, I will make that announcement in the next video. Um, so, if something does go wrong, I will let you know about it. This is a very transparent series, I hope. Uh, if you have questions about what I'm doing or anything, let me know. And I will answer them. Um, I think that's about it. If you are just kind of tuning in for that recap of the series, the rest of the episode will pretty much just be some mining. 
So I thank you all for watching that. If you if you were sticking around for that. Am I on the right level? Yeah. Grab some iron real quick. Nice. I think we can get rid of in favor of this cobblestone. Yeah, let's get rid of the gravel. I hate gravel, by the way. Uh, so get used to that. <laughs> if you if you're gonna become a viewer of this series, despise gravel and get rid of some cobblestone in favor of that redstone. A lot of redstone today. Not entirely sure exactly how common it is, but it seems to be common enough. But I'm finding it everywhere. I do pretty much have mending on all of my stuff. Um, all four of my tools I do have mending on. I don't think any of my armor. No, not yet. But there will become a time. There will come a time when there is mending on my armor as well. I imagine. Although that's significantly less crucial, as the armor is not really going to take that much of a beating. Hello. Yeah, we've been here before. Ah, goodness. How much redstone do you need? And there it is. I was about to mention we haven't found any gold yet, but now we have. Yeah, five gold. Not bad. Not ideal, but gotta start somewhere. Um, whoa. More redstone. I am doubting that there will be very many redstone like contraptions in this series. Um, or instant farmers or whatever. I just don't think there's that much need for them. An automatic farm, I don't think is going to have that much use. This is going to be a long enough series that I don't think I'm going to need that. I'm pretty sure most of the things that I would have an automatic farm for are things that I don't need enough of to require that automatic farm. Uh, for example, sugarcane, you know, I don't actually need that much sugarcane. I'm quite confident that I can come up with the chestfuls that I'm going to need before I can come up with a chestful of, you know, gold blocks, for example. So I'm not imagining too many problems. Let me run back with this cobblestone real quick. So I think I'll start smelting it to make smooth stone. I do also need some experience for this axe, so. Let's do that, and then apparently we have that cooking team. Run stone, why not? So that's a nice sound of the fire. Let me make some more redstone blocks. Throw in the coal. Oops. Oh, this away. Okay. Hey. Come on. I will also, one of these episodes, be putting up kind of signs around so I kind of know where each item is, at least relatively close. In the chest in the basement, that's what we're calling it now. Right, so I just so I kind of know a little bit more exactly where each that was not ideal. Just so I know a little bit more where each chest is, otherwise having to search around for a specific chest someday is going to be remarkably not fun. Go, I'll keep this little bit of coal next to me. Right. 
that. And gold can go in here. Yeah, let's go and throw it in here. This is kind of my valuables chest. I won't be making big runs into the basement unless I need to. Which are kind of my working set of diamonds. What can we get on the chest plate that we enchanted? Protection three, okay. I'm definitely going for fire protection on this helmet, which I think I have. At fire protection three, I think that'll do. I'm not imagining falling into lava anytime soon. So I don't think I'm gonna have need for anything greater than that. I have enough cobblestone. Let me fill up the cobblestone chest right now. This is gonna take a couple runs because my inventory is way too full. But cobblestone's pretty close to the start. I think. Oh. Absolutely have enough of the stuff to fill it. Don't have any stone lying around. I didn't think I did, but I thought I'd check it out. And boom, that is it. We are done with cobblestone. One chest completed in this series. I don't have a way to mark these. I'm going to put a torch over it for now. Although I said no torches, so that might have to not be it. We're going to come up with something. I think I'll put glowstone here. Although that's going to require a lot of glowstone. So. We'll see. But cobblestone is done. This is now just extra. These aren't anywhere really close to done, so I will let's go back downstairs and we'll do a little bit more mining. Let's do another round of it. There we go. Let me use dirt instead of stone. Oh, I don't want to be down here. There we go. Let me kind of expand this out. I would go to the right, but that I'm going to have to go all the way down and expand the back line out, so I'll do that another time. There we go. Okay. And off we go. That's probably the most efficient way to get rid of the gravel. Just kind of hold mouse one and let it do its own work. I love the office. Great. Oh, look, redstone. Who would have guessed? With the fortune, um, the actual amount of diamonds ore needed for the series is a little bit less. Oh my. No? The holding mouse one strategy is working, so far at least. Right. On the same level at least, we go. So hopefully we can find some diamonds. Also, do I have my silk touch pick with me? Yes, so I do have a silk touch pick. Silk touch pick. Or when I decide I want to collect the actual ores of things like coal and emerald, as well as diamond. Um, oh, I just broke a diamond. Well, we found some diamond, everybody. Got two diamonds from that one ore. A small vein, I would guess, overwritten by the iron vein. Let me dig around a little bit just in case there's a, a corner vein somewhere. Nope. Okay, well, it still counts. We found two diamonds, so definitely we'll take that. We'll take that for sure. A lot of diamond ore needed. There's a lot of things that diamonds go into um, for what I would consider to be no reason. And they go into juke boxes and I think note blocks, maybe. That's not true. Enchanting tables, there's two of. So each, each one of those things is another chest full. Um, of diamonds. So 
that I'm going to need to collect. So, not super ideal, but at least stuff like the armor does not stack. So, don't have to worry about that as much. What goes on? Is there something back here? No. Okay. At some point, I'm definitely going to have to come up with a better system of transportation in these mines. This is going to, you know, go quite deep. So, we'll see if I come up with anything for that. The iron veins. And giant today. Oops, there's a village. That's pretty exciting. Not exactly sure what my target length for these episodes is. I don't really have one. Um, you know, somewhere between 35 minutes and an hour. If they're too short, I won't get anything done. If they're too long and they're super, super boring, so. We'll come up with a nice happy medium. They'll probably be about 40 minutes, 45 minutes long on average. Uh, but I think kind of the nice thing also is there's not any storyline that we're, we're missing if you miss out on a couple episodes. So, you know, skip as many as you need and come back. It'll be pretty much the same thing. I'll try to give a little bit of a recap at the start of each episode. That may or may not happen. End of defending. This this episode is going to be a little bit shorter. I'm gonna I'll stop once I get back from this mining run. Um, just because I do want it to be a little bit shorter. So it's a little easier to watch if somebody is just starting out. Oops. to need to make some more torches. Stupid gravel. Always getting in the way. And this lapis with the fortune, we get like a stack of lapis every time we find a vein of it. A vein of it. torches. Let's make another stack. Woo! <laughs> this shovel definitely goes through this stuff in a hurry. There's just a lot of ore down here. That's nice to see that we're still in extreme hills, at least for some of this. three emeralds that's good i have been saying a lot recently i'm very happy that emeralds um, are not in basically anything i don't think they're in anything other than emeralds and emerald blocks so we're essentially going to need 10 chestfuls of them or 270 stacks of emerald if you extrapolate out do we have a stack of gravel i can get rid of yes we do I'm still confused because I think this is close to the start, at least, in the front. Okay, 
I've been crazy. I eat some food real quick. I will take cobblestone instead of this flint, actually. Emerald! Yay! It'd also be nice if Emerald spawned in more than one veins. Nice, another three. Really good. Nice, and we're back that time. I will go collect the cobblestone. That's just gravel. Let me do this run back. Yeah, there's definitely going to have to be some kind of transportation creativity going on with this. Otherwise, it's going to end up being kind of a nightmare. Let me carry what stuff I can back. That chest was there from a very long time ago, I think. I've been kind of slowly emptying it as I go. Let me... Take this stuff out. Actually, let me... This does not have mending on it. I lied earlier. I'm sorry. I apologize to everybody who I've lied to. Let me go put... The stone away and the stone chest that I've just created. Nice. Whoops, the other stuff away. We got another six emeralds. We'll keep those. Keep the two diamonds. I'll put them in my working chest. The ores to be smelted, I guess I'll stick right here. The cobble can just kind of go away. Don't really need you. Throw these in here as well. Diamonds away. Do you have any ore to be? Take the emeralds out. Not really achieving anything. That's going to do it for this episode, everybody. We completed the cobblestone chest and kind of recapped the rules and regulations that are governing, governing this series. I hope to make this as regular as possible, as we are going to need a large number of episodes. Um, I'd like to also give shout outs to my friend Caleb, who came up with the idea for this series. I should have done that at the start. I do apologize for that. This series was his idea back maybe five or six years ago and it has continued ever since ever since now in this iteration and hopefully here to stay thank you all for watching i will see you next time take care